Stephen Hawking, who spent 55 years of his life bound to a wheelchair, was neither able to eat nor was able to speak. But he used to speak with the help of a computer. Although most of his theories and predictions came true, but Stephen Hawking is not among us anymore. But before his death, he did some terrible predictions about Earth's destruction, which if came true, then in the next 200 years, our world might go extinct. Welcome back again to Content Canvas. Viewers, at the age of 21, Stephen Hawking was diagnosed with a rare condition which generally occurs in people above age 50, and it's quite deadly. Doctors shared a life-shattering news with Stephen Hawking that he had only two years to live. Person whom life had given a two years ultimatum proved doctors wrong by living 55 years with this condition. He didn't let his condition get better of him. Rather, he wanted to make his condition his strength. Because of this condition, he was bound to the wheelchair and was unable to eat and even speak. He was fed with a tube and breathed through another tube. And for speaking, a special computer was attached to his wheelchair, and through a small muscle of his jaw, he used to type on the computer, which computer converts into speech and conveys his feelings to others. Almost all of his body parts stopped working, but he had one thing which was far stronger than any ordinary human beings. Stephen Hawking had an extraordinary brain which had a far greater capacity to think and analyze than normal human being. He published eight books while sitting in the wheelchair, and as the second greatest scientist after Einstein, he unveiled such facts about the universe that shook the world. Stephen Hawking presented theories that were later found to be true, which includes black holes. On one hand, his theories amazed researchers and scientists. On the other hand, there are a lot of predictions of Stephen Hawking that have made people apprehensive and fearful. In these terrible predictions, Stephen Hawking had predicted how and when our planet Earth and its inhabitants will get decimated. Let us see what were these six predictions. Stephen Hawking believed that more than aliens humans are the biggest threat to themselves. In 2016, he said that the vaccines that are being made to fight against various viruses, many of them are genetically modified. That means they are made by genetically altering the virus's DNA so that the virus does not affect humans. Stephen Hawking believed that such vaccines are beneficial for a small period as it protects us from the virus. But in the long term, it can become the cause of extinction of humans because of DNA modifications. Nowadays, pharmacists are trying to come up with a single vaccine from a cocktail of different deadly viruses. And an example of that is the Rotatec vaccine, which was made to protect newborn babies from rotavirus. This vaccine was made by altering cow and human DNA. This vaccine definitely protects children from rotavirus, but time will tell if it contains any adverse effects or not. While bound to a wheelchair for 55 years, Stephen Hawking did a lot of research about the universe and concluded that life is present beyond Earth. And someday aliens will capture our planet. Let me tell you here that according to scientific theory, our universe was created as a result of the Big Bang. But Hawking's theory was a little different. He believed that multiple Big Bangs happened and every Big Bang created a different universe. That means Stephen Hawking believed in a parallel universe. Although there is no proof of the existence of another universe, but Stephen Hawking firmly believed that someday aliens will visit Earth to study us and gradually captured the Earth. Just two weeks before his death in 2018, Stephen Hawking published his final research paper to prove his theory of multiple universes, which was called A Smooth Exit from Eternal Inflation. In it, Hawking postulated that even though our universe was created due to a Big Bang, but still now it is expanding and a time will come when our universe will fall short of the energy to expand further. At that time, all the stars will gradually die and eternal darkness will settle across the universe. He believed that this will be the time when our universe will come to its end. Hawking strongly wanted humans to search and settle on a planet inside a parallel universe to protect our own species. Despite Stephen Hawking needing the aid of a robotic wheelchair, but he was very much against these robots. Although robots are built to make our work easier, but day by day they are becoming advanced. At present, there are many robots which perform such tasks through AI which seems impossible for us. 
Stephen Hawking predicted that one day robots will become so powerful that they would build another robot themselves. Humans have limited intelligence, e.g. Humans can see in only one direction at a time or do one work at a time, but the intelligence of robots can be enhanced to any level with which humans cannot compete. An example of such a robot can be found in Israel's Iron Dome, which is a highly intelligent air defense system. This Iron Dome can neutralize dozens of incoming missiles at once in the sky. Not only that, in just one MIS the robot inside it first detects and destroys those missiles that are going to fall in the populated area. Stephen Hawking predicted that one day, robots will be so powerful that they will try to control humans, and they will eventually succeed. We all know that violence is in the very nature of human beings which doesn't seem to end. And we can see that in the recent Russia and Ukraine war. To support their fights, humans have developed such weapons which can wipe out entire humanity in one go. These are also called weapons of mass destruction. In WW White's Eye, America dropped two atomic bombs on the two Japanese cities of Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The consequences are still evident even today. Stephen Hawking had predicted that if humans don't learn to live harmoniously together, then one day they will fight with each other and will start a nuclear war in which will be the last day of this world. Among the most terrible predictions of Stephen Hawking is global warming. Stephen Hawking believed that even if humanity escapes unscathed from every calamity, but in the coming 600 years, this place will become impossible for humans to live in. At that time, there will be no forest left, the seas will get dry, and no signs of humans. The most prominent reason will be the increasing population, and another reason would be the use of excess fossil fuel. Hawking believed that in 600 years, Earth's condition will be like that of Venus. The average temperature of Earth will rise up to 250 feet at sea. There will be rains of sulfuric acid instead of water, and blistering hot winds will reach speeds up to 360 kmrh. This heat is the same as it is required for cooking food in an oven. Viewers, the way Stephen Hawking turned Doctor's two years ultimatum into 55 years. Likewise, we can also increase the life of our Earth by planting a tree. Hope you will like and share this content canvas video. My heartfelt appreciation for your loving comments. We'll meet you in another amazing video.